The commander of the Islamic Revolution Guards Corps, IRGCS Aerospace Division, says Iran possesses global-level drone power and is now a pioneer in missile technology. Brigadier General Amirali Hajizada was speaking in a Sunday ceremony, saying that Iran stands on par with global powers in terms of unmanned aerial vehicles, and its achievements in this field have challenged the world's powerful armies. There are many other military achievements, which will be unveiled in due time, for example, the ability to hit enemy targets at a distance of 1,500 kilometers, the IRGC general said. Kajizada added that in terms of missile technology, Iran stands above the global level, adding, the news of the advanced hypersonic ballistic missile, which was broken recently and is able to maneuver outside the atmosphere is nothing new, but was just announced recently. He added that Iran's hypersonic missile represents a generational growth spurt and the enemies will not be able to come up with a new technology to counter it for many decades to come. Hajizadeh announced the development of Iran's homegrown hypersonic ballistic missile on November 10, saying it is as capable of penetrating sophisticated aerial defense shields and striking designated targets. The missile has a high velocity and can maneuver both in and out of the Earth's atmosphere he said, adding the new missile can pass through all missile defense systems, it can target the enemy's anti-missile systems, and its production marks a huge leap in the development of a new generation of missiles. Meanwhile, a high-ranking commander of Iran's Islamic Revolution Guards Corps, IRGC, says the country has developed a homegrown hypersonic ballistic missile, which is capable of penetrating sophisticated aerial defense shields and striking designated targets. The missile has a high velocity and can maneuver both in and out of the Earth's atmosphere Brigadier General Amir Ali Hajizadeh, the commander of the IRGC's Aerospace Division, told reporters on Thursday. The new missile can pass through all missile defense systems, and I don't think that the technology capable of countering it will be achieved in the decades to come. It can target the enemy's anti-missile systems, and its production marks a huge leap in the development of a new generation of missiles as it pointed out. On Sunday, Iran's defense ministry unveiled the upgraded version of the domestically designed and manufactured Bever 373, Belief 373, surface-to-air missile system, and inaugurated the production line of the long-range Sayed B-4 missile. Bever 373 system was initially capable of destroying targets at 200 kilometers, and now the upgraded system, aiming to attack targets at very long ranges, including ballistic missiles, fighter aircraft, and bombers, can destroy targets at 300 kilometers, Iranian Defense Minister Brigadier General Mohammad Reza Eshtiani during the unveiling ceremony. The missile system can engage up to six targets at a time and destroy them, he said, stressing that many technologically advanced countries aspire to possess such a system. The Bever 373 system detection radar was said to have increased from 350 to 450 kilometers, and the range of its engagement range has risen from 260 to 400 kilometers, the report added. It also noted that the missile range has gone from 200 to 300 kilometers, and its engagement altitude has increased from 27 to 32 kilometers. The report also announced the launching of the Sayed B-4 missiles production line, pictured below, 
saying the long-range missile, running on solid propellant, was operationally evaluated for the first time. The Baver 373 system was formally unveiled during a ceremony attended by former Iranian President Hassan Rouhani on August 22, 2019. It was reported at the time that the road mobile system can detect targets or planes at more than 300 kilometers, lock them at about 250 kilometers, and destroy them at 200 kilometers. Iran for the first time employed the homegrown Baver 373 missile defense system during a joint air defense exercise, codenamed Guardians of Belay at Sky 99, in late October 2020. Iranian military experts and technicians have in recent years made substantial headway in manufacturing a broad range of indigenous equipment, making the armed forces self-sufficient in the armed sphere. Iranian officials have repeatedly warned that the country will not hesitate to strengthen its military capabilities, including its missile power, which are entirely meant for defense, saying the Islamic Republic's defense capabilities will be never subject to negotiations.